All right, this is literally the third time doing this. The other two, for some reason, they decided to collapse on me. And it's getting, it's getting really annoying, guys. Like, it, it's really busting my chops. Hold up, hold on. I'm, I'm fixing my new mic. I got a new mic. I'm going to keep on saying I got a new mic in my neck in all my episodes. <laughs> oh, my God. Anyway, any further ado, let's do this. Shit! Alright, you know if you have a pair of balls in between your legs, you know you grew up with this man saying, By God, every time a wrestler did something, you were like, By God, too. <laughs> Hell no. <laughs> But yeah, uh, that's it. Next. All right, this next one says, Wheels on shopping carts be like, and it's like, the last, the, the rear left one just doesn't want to help you. And I feel that. I feel that every single time I go to Aldi, I always get the one with the retarded fucking wheel on it. Hate it here. I hate it here, man. Uh-uh. And you gotta push it to one side a little more than the other, and, and, and now you just look like a... Like, like you're frustrated. <laughs> and you know you're frustrated. Yeah, I hate... I hate that. Next. Okay, okay, I see Miles Morales over here. Look at him, being all dash and dapper. Look, my man got... AirPods, he got a, he got a, the diamond set right there. He got the diamond clothes. He got, he got 21 diamonds too. Not just, not just 20, but he has 21. 21, guys. Can you believe that? But this is just one of those photos where I just look at it and I'm like, I'm just crying. I'm just laughing. But anyway, any further ado, next. Hold up, hold up, hold up. I'm taking this man to the fucking shadow realm real quick. Look at this. My man got a head brighter than my future. The tattoo parlors <laughs> even fucked up his hairline. He, they push that shit back all the way back. How do you have a hair tattoo and that shit still receipts? I don't get it. That's terrible, man. That's freaking terrible. My man over here got the LeBron special. Is it just me? Or does anyone else want to smack the fuck out this man's head? I got a perfect song for you, by the way. Shine bright like a diamond. <laughs> Shine bright like a diamond. <laughs> Hell no, bro. How you getting fucked over like that? Bro, just throw the whole head away. <laughs> Actually, no. Matter of fact, just sue the whole place. Sue whoever did that. I don't care if it's hair, tattoo, uh, uh, mold. Sue. Trust me. They fucked you over, bro. <laughs> Hell no. That shit that shit looks ratchet as fuck. <laughs> My man over here looking like a pearl. Hell no. Hell no. Hell fucking no. You gotta, gotta be out of your damn mind. For this shit to happen right here. This this right here, this is every guy's nightmare. You in bed and you Pop out a boner. You you pop you pop a woody. And now you got you got a raging dick popping out of the sheets. And out of nowhere, she pops one too. Fuck that. <laughs> you're out of your damn mind. I can tell you this. If your girlfriend had a dick, you know damn well she would smack the fuck out of you with that fucking dong. You go up to your girlfriend and be like, baby, if you had a dong, would you smack the fuck out of me? Most likely, she'll say, fuck yeah. Hell no. Fuck this. <laughs> next. Alright, this next one is a uh, text. It says, why did Sarah fall off the swing? I don't know why. She had no arms. And the, the guy gives off like a, like a weird, like, okay, reaction, face, whatever. 
and the guy says knock knock who's there not sarah <laughs> this is like the the most fucked up i love jokes like this i don't know why but it's just like so fucked up it's funny that's how it is man like if you have a if you have a a two-part joke that's just dark and funny you gotta say it to me at least I, I remember i found one in the internet started sending it to people it was like it went like this how did stevie wonder burn off his ear someone called and he answered the iron how did stevie wonder burn off his other ear same person called back what's black and loud stevie wonder answering the iron <laughs> That's fucked, man. Jokes like this, like these, pretty much just make me laugh instantly. It's just the, the fucked uppery, as, as you can say, that makes me laugh. It's like the audacity in me. <laughs> Alright, next. Fucking same. This next one says, when you find someone who is just as dead inside as you are, and that is so true. When you find, when you, when you personally find someone that you connect to, dude, that is the best, bro. I literally have a new coworker, and like she's the funnest person I've ever fucking met. She is funny. She gets my jokes sometimes, and, and I just say a whole bunch of fucked up shit, and and she laughs with me, man. You guys gotta find. Someone like not a, not someone who who I can't believe I'm making this into our inspirational shit. I don't want to, <laughs> but yes, yes to Depresso Expresso. Yes to fucked up jokes. Yes. <laughs> oh my god. Anyway, um, that concludes pretty much this uh episode of myths um i don't know i don't know how to close this out um thanks guys later peace and that even though no one really watches my shit anyway you know cries in uh cries in spanish